All right, so we can look at uh, moving objects one more time and how we have the option of moving a box, right? So we can click and we grab our black arrow, our selection tool. This is the one, so we can click and we can move a box, okay? But we can also then go in and move the content inside the box. So this is the perfect example. Here is my, the, 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 the box that's holding this image. Okay, so when, how did I create this? Well, I created it with the rectangle frame tool. But then we can come in and we can actually grab the content inside of the, the box. And we do that, we can see when we see this little image in the center, this is the content grabber. So if we come in and we double click, okay, we get another little box and this is the blue. This is also the color if I was to come in and start pulling out guides. Okay, so now once I have that clicked and I can see this highlighted, I can come in and watch this. I can move the content inside of the frame. And that may be something that I want to do quite a bit. Now, how do I get out of here? Well, I can click off and then look, I can just move the whole content independently. Um, I can move the, everything together. Um, now, this one's a little bit different right back here because I did not put this in a box, all right? All I did was I just came in, I said file place. So you can see that this may be an advantage, um, you know, creating a content frame with the rectangle frame tool, one of these tools right in here, and placing it inside of a shape may be the way to go. So there we have it, two different ways that uh, we can move our objects, mm -hmm. our graphics on our page. Um, first thing is coming in and moving the overall box. And even watch this, when I come in and I start changing the size of this, see how the size of it changes? But it changes independently of the content. Now I can come in and click and get this box and I could come in and start resizing that in here as well. All right, so there we have it. Thanks for listening.